right now. It's a graph showing data from the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics. You can see on the bottom three jobs with median annual wages below $45,000 suffered the heaviest loss during that three year span across our entire state. That includes for food service, down more than 20,000 jobs during that time frame. Senior researcher Joe Peter Angelo tells me most job growth is happening in higher paying jobs, usually requiring higher education levels and more training. That creates some challenges. Jobs picture and the workforce picture is really difficult and requires a lot of attention and effort to, to really produce the workforce we need. Coming up in the next half hour, which jobs are more likely to see a boost on their paychecks? Live in Green Bay, Emily Roberts, Action 2 News.